All right, we just made it to the job this morning, and uh, today what we're going to be doing is basically doing a bunch of cleanup. It's a nice day, but it's supposed to be getting colder throughout the day. The wind's going to pick up, so we're going to try to get a lot of this picked up this morning, and then I'm going to start building that beam inside the the living room. We just got back from the building supply and got the lumber that I need, so Sam's here helping me. He's going to help me get this place, try to get it cleaned up as much as we possibly can, and uh, see what we can if we can get it get all this stuff picked up so i pulled all the carpet here and then we got all this trash we got to pick up and all this we got to clean up and get rid of so we're gonna get it all in this dumpster here i think this will open i think this door opens right here somehow i think we can get it open and then we can just walk the stuff right in okay. or whatever they're called. <laughs> yeah. That's how I felt pulling that carpet out oh. because it has all that nasty urine. Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah, it had a big old dog that's supposed to fade in there, I think. Yeah. Time. And then I'm going to shoot you guys up my way and see. Yeah, right there. Okay. You got it a second? Yeah. screw in it until I get that other one then I'm gonna put some boards underneath it. guys we got I got the beam in across here and got a bunch of braces underneath it to hold the ceiling up they didn't even have a header in there see we ripped this part off they didn't have it but we're ripping the wall out right now we got the all the wiring out of it pretty much and now we're just um, gonna pull the rest of these boards off here and then we can clear this out and then from that wall on I'm gonna chalk a line to this wall here and then we're gonna put in a we're going to put in a header all the way across there and then put two beams underneath it.
right guys, took the temporary post down and we got the beam in all the way across there, double beam, two by eight with two posts on it. So what we're gonna do is put the island right in between these two like this with it going into the kitchen because of all this space. We'll be able to put the dining room table over here in this spot and then the kitchen counter instead of there being stuff over here. Um, it'll go across the cabinets will go across here and then where this wall is I'm gonna have to move this switch and then we'll put the fridge right here So got that wall out and got the beam in and it is. today it's a good day because Anna and the kids are flying home from California so I went and went there for Thanksgiving and um, got to be with them for a little bit but then I had to come back and get back to work and they stayed for a little bit longer so I'm gonna get to see them but um, uh, I have some guys working on the house right now so what we're gonna do is we're going up here and we're gonna see if we can get some siding and some windows um, and see if we can find some of the stuff that we want. We're gonna head to Menards up here and see if we can get the stuff that we need. I already looked at the siding that I want and I know they have it in stock, so I'm gonna pick up it and then I gotta get some windows. I'm probably gonna have to get uh, a few different, some of these are windows that are in the house are a little bit strange sizes, different weird sizes. So I know they're not gonna have it, so I'm either gonna have to frame in a little bit or knock a few two by fours out so that the windows that I get are gonna fit. Um, the house. So I'm getting ready to pull up here to Menards and we'll get the material that we need and then we'll go pick up Anna here in a little bit after we get done here. grab another cart real quick I think I can get the rest of them on this one hopefully I don't know if I can or not I got all the windows loaded up. Found pretty much what I needed, so that's good that I got all those. Now I now I gotta go get my siding. Alright, I came up here where the siding is. We're gonna try to find it.
36, so it's pretty good timing. They're supposed to land at like 110. So I got plenty of time to get over there to them. They're out there checking to make sure, I guess here they check and make sure that you didn't get anything you weren't supposed to get. It's a camera. Give me a Hey, 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 do you want to go get in the car? Do you want to go get in the truck? Do you? Paisley, how did you get that, those wings on so your... this girl... How did you get those wings on your... Where'd you get those from? It's from the airplane. The airplane gives me it. The airplane gives to me it. <laughs> Alright guys, we got all the windows stacked inside here, so we're going to start taking them out um we're gonna monday i think is when we're gonna start working on taking them out and replacing putting the new ones in and then had a guy working here all day today and he got all that white siding they had red vertical underneath it so we're just gonna nail it to that just like the other but as you can see it's all gone and he got all that done for me so that's super nice so monday we won't have to worry about taking the siding off we can just start taking the windows off we're supposed to maybe get a little bit of rain Monday, so I hopefully it won't mess, it won't be too bad. It's only like a 30% chance, so I hope it don't pour on us, but we'll have to see how it goes. I hope you guys enjoy this fixing this house. Make sure that you subscribe so you can watch along because next week it's going to look totally different. We're going to get a lot of that outside done. It's going to look really good, so I'm super excited about that. Hopefully. Hopefully we can get it done in a timely man manner and don't run into any problems. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Comment below what you like about the house and what you don't like. And we will see you guys on the next one.